and welcome back to Counter Counter. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a, a cumulative tack haul and stuff um, video. Um, basically, even though I'm not riding, I had a lot of money left over from holiday and decided to buy stuff with it. So I thought I would film it for you guys. Um, and I don't know, maybe it'll give you some ideas of, you know, stuff to buy or whatever. So before we begin, I just want to do a few little announcements sort of things. Um, number one is, I'm very sorry that I sound like this. I've actually been quite ill for a couple of days. Um, so I apologise that I sound so nasal. Um, <laughs> okay, so number two is, thank you guys so much for 300 and a bit subscribers. Um, it's absolutely mental. We've both been just looking at it as it's like going up and up and up and it seems to have gone up so quickly so we might be doing a giveaway at 500 but if not it would definitely be at a thousand so keep your eyes out for that and number three is um i just want to get your thoughts on if you would want sort of dog walk vlogs um because as i mentioned in my last video i've now got a dog um and i didn't know whether you wanted um that to be something that's additional to this channel um, obviously it won't be all the time because obviously this is a horse channel but I was just thinking of maybe doing a few vlogs of our adventures or what we get up to um, and stuff so let me know if you want to see some of that and I'll get on to it okay so let's get started um, I'm gonna go in date order if I can remember when I bought all this stuff um, this is sort of as far back as July so if I don't get in order then Okay, so the first thing I got was a pair of breeches. Turn them right around. These are the um, HKM Ms. Blink breeches, I believe, if I can remember rightly. And I actually bought this for some of my birthday money back in July. Um, I think it was about £60, possibly. I can't actually remember. So they just look like this. Um, I've got this really nice high-waisted um, back with this little logo there um, and the diamantes on the front and they also they don't have the sock bottom which is a pain but they're really nice breeches so they just have the velcro bottom um, and as I said they were about 60 to 70 pounds and I got them off of eBay um, I haven't ridden them in, in them yet, obviously, but I saw them and I was just like, yep, yeah, I need those. So, so I brought them. I can't wait to ride on those because I tried them on and the support the high waist give you and they just, they just look stunning really, so. Okay, so secondly, obviously, I'm going to include him even though it's technically not a tackle, um, is the puppy and I will insert a video here. Um, he is a 14 week old border collie puppy going by the name of Loki. Uh, he is obviously the thing that we brought in August around about and he's a family dog but I think he's gelled a little bit more with me than the rest of my family because I'm still looking for a job so I've been at home really. Okay so the next thing I got, I actually got when I was away on holiday it got delivered um, and I had no idea that it was going to get delivered um, it was a competition in horse and rider magazine and if they happen to be watching um, thank you very much for them it was a really nice surprise to get back on holiday um, and this is the Lilydale animal health shampoo um, in oh it's sticky it is it smells like aloe vera it doesn't say, but it smells like aloe vera and I haven't actually been using it on a horse because I haven't got one <laughs> so I've been using it on the dog which, it's sensitive, like very sensitive it says it's a rich but gentle shampoo so I've been using it on the dog <laughs> for when he rolls in junk and obviously I can't tell you how it is for horses but if it's anything to go by what the dog smells like he smells absolutely amazing, it just smells like a normal horse shampoo. And along with that I got the Lilydale Coat Shine Spray, which I haven't actually used yet I, because obviously I haven't got a horse and I don't really want to put it on the dog just because, well, we, we've put him on food that actually is really good for his, his skin anyway, so he's shiny as anything already. Um, I'm not too sure if I'll use it or not, but if not maybe I will stick it in the giveaway, perhaps. 
The next two things I ordered uh, when I got back from holiday, um, which was a couple of polo shirts. You know how much I love Jules and how much I love their products and the polo shirts. So I just brought this, which is a really nice polo shirt. It was actually the first thing I won a bid on, which can't complain. I got it for £2.50 I think. Yeah, I think it was £2.50 in total with like £3 postage, so I actually got it cheaper than the postage, so. But it's so detailed. It's got sort of this really nice button at the top here. Um, and so it's got this badge and on each sleeve it's got a little emblem thing cuffs it's got this red and gold and this is the thing I really like on the collar here it's got like this really nice logo on the back so yeah it, you, there's a lot of thought that's been put into it basically and I've got this one um, which is slightly bigger this is a size 10 my other one was a size 8 and most of my other ones are size 8 um, but I found this one in the sale, which was only in a 10, so I just brought it, and it's not too baggy. I do prefer my polos to be fitted, but it's not too baggy, so it's fine. And again, this one is really, really detailed. I mean, just look at that crest there. It's just, it's crazy how good that crest is. And even the one the other side is just mental, but the other one is so nice. And then on the sleeve, it's just got badminton horse trials and yeah it's a really nice polo shirt and it's really nice in the summer because obviously it's white so yes I got that one the next thing I got was this cable knit jumper which isn't actually an equestrian brand it's by Kangol I think that's how you say it um, and I actually got this from Sports Direct and if you live in the UK you probably have quite a few of these these stores dotted around but this is in their ladies wear range and I just thought it would be good in the winter for um, putting over a polo like you know when you have that awkward phase where it's too hot to wear a jacket but it's too cold just to go in a polo so yeah that's why I got this it's quite long as well which could be a problem but I've worn it and it's very warm but that was that was 14 99 from there reduced from £30. What a deal. I'm sorry there wasn't a major amount of things. Um, as I said, I'm not really riding at the moment, so I don't see the point of getting loads of stuff. Um, but hopefully I'll be able to get a job soon <laughs> if someone will employ me <laughs> and then I can buy myself a horse um, and then get back into riding. So yes, I apologise for how I've been sounding, like I said. And if you do want to see those dog vlogs of me walking him and where we're going and stuff, because it's quite a nice countryside and whatever, just let me know down below and I will take that into account in our future videos. But don't worry, it's not going to be a dog um, YouTube channel, it'll be specifically for horses, it's just easier for me to actually have something else to film if you know what I mean. So yes, and I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in our next video. Bye guys!